Astrid feeding her baby her tail going a hundred mile an hour baby just went and did his business this is Papa checking them out here good girl Astrid again we're still in Edmonton on Calgary Trail Thursday the 10th of March puppies had a good sleep they slept about five hours they are now four weeks old you see how they go a distance to do their job their business and they are already being trained to go outside I drove here close to where there's grass and I gave them a chance to come out and have a good run that's Calgary Trail in northern Alberta and cleans them still she's a good mother she really is come honey come good girl puppies all together we have no names for them yet Usually my daughters give them names, so they'll work on it. Again, I said four weeks old. Oh, it's wait. Yeah, you wait. No need to run. It's okay. Good boy, Tanner. Good boy. Good boy. See, when they see a stranger or someone who's looking a little different, the papa want to go and send him away hello say hi come give him your hand so he knows you're friendly yeah give him your hand there you go it's okay there he's okay Tanner he's not gonna hurt the babies good boy good boy they are cute <laughs> yes yes they a uh, what? Oh yes, oh yeah, they, we're training them to be outside. We're training them to be outside. And Are you going to keep them all? Or? Oh no, <laughs> they need homes. 
Yeah. How much do you sell the puppies for? They are $700. 700 eh? Cocker Spaniels. Yeah, purebred. Purebred. They get all their shots and ready to go in four weeks. We're traveling, that's why I have them out here. And Mama is saying, hug me and love me. I'll hug you and love you, honey. Yes, I will. There you go. Did, did her health decline toward the end of her pregnancy, like just before she got... No. Hurt? Did her health decline a bit? No, not at all. We, we feed her good. That helps a lot. Of course, the last day, uh, the last day she was in distress, just like any woman. Yeah, yeah. And My parents' dog, they had a Bichon Frise and a Shih Tzu Cross. Oh. And when it got pregnant, it had seven puppies. And it was such a small little dog that right the last two or three days, yeah. she lost all her hair. Oh, and, she did? Yeah, and she got diabetes just up till the day she got pregnant and then uh, she was okay after that. Really? Wow. But her little body, she was just a little bigger than the puppy and she had seven puppies. Oh, she was young. Oh, so yeah. She, she uh, went through a lot of stress. Yeah, yeah. She yeah. went through a lot of stuff there. Yeah. Well, yeah, I'm not sure... We have to search it and Google it to see uh, if it will happen to my dog. She had seven, but she lost one because I didn't know I have to break the sack. And and, uh, and they suffocated. One of the pups suffocated because of the sack on his face. Oh, really? Yeah. And I didn't know I have to help him. He died right right in my hands i was so sad that was the second one and after that my wife told me to break the sack around their mouth with my finger and i i helped she usually does it but she went through some stress yeah yeah, that's why I'm taking a video of them. It's nice to uh, to see. Yeah, she's a good mother. She's playing with them now. I'd let her go free. She'd stay around me, but if if you walk in there, she will run all the way, and then her babies can't run with her, and I'm worried about that. Yeah. So you helping at the hotel here today? Yeah, yeah. I work here at the hotel. Been here eight years. Wow, what a what a treasure, you know. I'm so happy. What's your name? My name is Wade. Wayne? Wade. Wade. I I am Nabil, yeah. Nabil, pleased to meet you. Yeah, God bless you, Wade. Hi, little puppy. You have you have still children at home or Oh, I'm a single guy. Okay, yeah. Yeah, a puppy needs a lot of attention, needs a lot of love. Oh yeah. And if you love them, they really respond. Okay, well, God bless you. You too. We'll see you again, Wade.